In this tutorial, I'll be demonstrating how you can fix the problem where when you go to Internet Options and go to the Temporary Internet File Settings, you see this phrase where it says, please select the value between 8 and 8 for how much disk space Temporary Internet Files may use. And when you normally go to the Internet Options and go to the Browser History Settings, you should see it say, uh, the space to use between 8 and 1024 megabytes and mine set to 250 but when this error occurs it'll say 8 to 8 and you'll have difficulties in uh, opening or downloading PDF files or printing from PDF files on certain uh, internet websites so basically you go to your registry editor by going to the run dialog and typing in regedit and this brings up the registry editor now one thing you should keep in mind that before making any changes to your registry you need to make a backup. So right here you right click on the key that contains your sub keys and choose export and then basically give it a, a name like temp and save it to your desktop. And this basically creates a uh, registry file that by double clicking on will uh, revert any changes that you made to the registry in case you cause a problem. And I'll basically add that information back into the registry and undo any changes you made. And when there, once you're in here, you're going to uh, navigate to the HK Current User Software, Microsoft, Windows, Current Version, Internet Settings, and 5. So I have it listed here on the screen, and you see here it's under HK Current User, then Software, then you go to the sub one of Microsoft, Windows, Current Version, and finally go down to Internet Settings, and under the Registry Key 5, and you'll see two different keys here, one called Cache, one called Low Cache. You basically want to right-click on them and click Rename, and rename them to something like Cache-Old, and here I'm not actually going to be making the changes because I'm not having the problem on my system, but you'd want to change the name and then leave it to the change name and do the same thing with the low cache. And once you finish changing the names, you close it and then open up your Internet Explorer again. And then when you go into Internet Options, you should see the correct settings here. Uh, and the problem is fixed. If you like this video, uh, please give it a uh, thumbs up below. And also, if you like my videos, uh, I would encourage you to subscribe to my channel. Thank you.